Hi, I'm Sean from Eve Organics, and today we're going to give you two quick steps for natural looking lips. These are the two products we're going to focus on today, which is our lip liner, and I'm going to use Sweet Merlot, that's the color I like to use, and our lip balm, our peppermint lip balm. Um, the purpose of this is as we age, unfortunately, we would start to lose the definition around our lip area, so it's not as pronounced. If you were younger, back in your teens or 20s, you can just throw on some lip balm and you look great and you're good to go. But when you're in your 40s, um, it just really gives you much more definition to go ahead and line, and if you fill in with the liner as well, that gives you some added color and some added extended wear when you put your lip balm over top. In addition, if you fill in your lips with the lip liner, it just gives you added long-lasting wear and color, and then when you put the lip balm over top, you have some extra shine. So the first step is we're going to apply the aligner. I'm going to kind of talk as I'm doing it. Everybody's a little different in the look they're trying to achieve. You may have very thin lips that you're trying to overemphasize, and in that case, you're you're going to probably apply your liner just past the the normal line of your lips. You may have bigger lips that you're trying to minimize, and in that case, you're going to want to go inside the lip line. Um, as far as coloring in, the darker you go, the more it's going to accentuate, and the lighter you go with your sh shading, the less it's going to accentuate. So it just, I'm going to do it the way I do it, and then just keep those tips in mind when applying them to yourself. So I tend to go a little bit past my lip, my natural lip line on my upper lip. And then if you have, you know, if you want to make your, your mouth look a little smaller, you could come in, maybe not follow all the way on the outside, but maybe cut your line in a little. That is up to you. So first I'm just going to line it and show you before I fill it in. So there it is, just lined. So now I'm going to go ahead and fill in. And just take your pencil kind of on an angle, you're not going to go direct on, that's not going to go on so well, just kind of like this. Actually, my lips are very much in need of lip balm right now <laughs> from this long winter. So there it is filled in and really, so when your lip balm wears off, your lips still look nice because you have some color and some definition to them. To achieve the look that I'm showing you today, it would be best to use our Eve Organics Lip Balm. Um, when applied, ours does give you a different look. Um, typically, most uh, lip balms kind of give you a very flat, kind of a waxy feel on your lips. Ours is very moisturizing and it kind of gives you that luminescent kind of uh, eggshell type finish. Uh, just a hint of shine, but it just doesn't look flat and waxy. Um, it's very moisturizing and it's peppermint and it just gives you that little bit of oomph and just kind of perks up your lips, that's all. So you, here you have the look which is the liner and the lip balm. And as an added bonus, I'm going to show you how to add that little bit of a pout. Remember how I was talking about the shading and the lighter <clears throat> can less accentuate a certain area of your lip? I'm going to take a little bit of our Bubbles lip gloss. It's very um, frosty, very light in color. And I'm going to apply it to my lower lip to just give that appearance of a little bit of a pout to the lower lip. Mm -hmm. 
So there you go. Here's just a nice, quick, natural, long-lasting look. Maybe you just want to run out the door and that's all you want to do and you'll feel good for the day. So remember, we're Eve Organics, made by real women for real women. So if you liked our video, share it with a friend.